Hello, how are you guys doing? This is very important in reference to human anatomy of different races and unique qualities of individuals and factual history and information about identities of parents. These people tried to steal my penis and tried to call me their child because they had a smaller penis than my father. Or these people had smaller penises than my grandfather's. So who are you to have a problem with another person's child's penis? We want to know why you think a person that has a big penis, you thought you could terrorize them. You thought you could damage things of their lives. We need you to put it on paper. We need you in court. Why do you think somebody has a big penis and that person with the big penis seems to bother you? I don't date your daughter. Not ever going to date your daughter. I don't date any girl that has a problem with my big penis. And I don't date certain races or religions either. So why do you seem to have a problem with somebody having a big penis? I was born with a big penis. My penis has been documented since I was born. Why do you have a problem with somebody's little nose? Why do you have a problem with somebody's beautiful teeth? Who are you? I'm not your race or religion, government man, and you're not a friendly race of people, and friendly people wouldn't do these things that you've done to me. So who are you? Why are you stealing my money? Why are you holding me hostage? Why did you steal monies from my mother and father and my mother and father's estates? Why are you blocking me from my mother and father's mansions? What do you think you're doing for me here in Indiana? When your people had kidnapped me from another city and state. Let's look at the list of history of quality of life that your people are trying to steal from me. The quality of my mother and father's mansions and the accounts my parents had set up for me. You'll say something like probably, well, they didn't think you deserve to be rich. They don't, you don't deserve to be who you are. You don't deserve to live that lifestyle. Well, I was born into that lifestyle. My parents gave me everything. And it's my mother and father's money, not your money. And my money's in reference to my accomplishments, not your accomplishments, freak. You're trying to steal my identity. You're trying to steal my family history. You're trying to steal my wealth. Who are you? Who are you? You're trying to steal... My family history that I was born into, that my parents gave to me, and my accomplishments. And don't forget, I've been a celebrity entertainer since I was a little boy. And you might be surprised to find out which celebrity entertainers I have been. Such as TV shows when I was little and other things and music. You might be surprised. And there are some musical groups that might want me to be a lead singer. And some of the musical groups, somebody might say, you know, lots of things of importance. And uh, uh, I haven't received any letters from anybody in the postal mail. And the Music Hall of Fame or the TV and Film Industry Museum or the Stuntmen of Hollywood or business companies or computer companies. I haven't received any of the letters in the mail from anybody or uh, from anything from Wall Street either. So it's a big story of uh, very important seriousness. But, you know, this man, why do you, the, the satellite man or the satellite woman, why do you have a problem with somebody having a round ass, man? I'm an athlete. I've rode bicycles. I've walked on treadmills. I've and jogged on treadmills. I might even have the, the fastest mile on a treadmill in history. Somebody has to look up that information. <coughs> they just hit me in the throat. So, government man, why do you have a problem with somebody having a bigger penis than you? Or why do you have a problem with somebody having a big penis? I'm not gay. Not going to be gay. And you're blocking me from my relationships with friends and females? Who are you? Who are you? Are you trying to dictate who my friends or celebrity entertainers that are friends of mine, that have been friends of mine since I was a little boy or since, you know, in reference to my Hollywood career? Are you trying to dictate their lives too, man? You don't have any authorization to be dictating my life. 
and you're still burning my ass. They've been burning my ass all day. Who are you? I'm not gay. Why are you nitpicking on me? You have no right touching me. You thought you would burn on me and try to play your germaphobe terrorism? Because you thought you thought you were going to be touching my flesh? You thought you were going to try to get up close and personal on my anatomy when there's restraining orders against you? Wonder what you're trying to do, government man. You're sitting there trying to nitpick on somebody, burning on me. You're trying to nitpick on me and you've been burning on me? Because of what reason, sicko? Because you thought that you were going to try to put your hands on me? You thought you were going to try to get up near me? And you thought somebody was dirty? And you spied on me in the shower all these years, burning on me, hitting me in the face and the teeth when I'm washing my face under the shower head? And they've been hitting me in the face when I wash my face in the kitchen sink. With my foster uh, faucet. So who are you, government man, to have a problem with somebody else's life? My financial portfolio information has to be advertised. Because these government people are trying to claim they're trying to overshadow me. Or they're trying to claim that they thought that I was a nobody. And they were overshadowing me trying to play their illegal censorship of who I am. My rights. Let's put all your information in the courtroom. And put all my information in the courtroom. And let's see who has the higher card, man. And the more accomplishments. Hello, Screen Actors Union. Somebody communicated. Lots of things of importance. I haven't received any of the lawsuit monies from anywhere. Or the insurance money from anywhere either. I'm over here at the little house, 315. And I just talked to Sony PlayStation on the phone. Main things of importance. And hello, MGM Studios. And hello, Hollywood History. And business industries. And Wall Street. And friendly countries. And friendly people. Lots of things of importance. And hello, truck drivers. And Teamsters. And importing and exporting of products and goods. Internationally and worldwide. How you guys doing? Hello, friendly countries, Asia, Korea, China, Japan, Malaysia, Taiwan, and other countries, and England, of course, love jolly England, and France, and Italy, and Ireland, and Great Britain, and Canada, and Mexico, and South America, friendly acknowledgments of people, and hello, Alaska, wonderful acknowledgments, Alaska, how you guys doing? I haven't received anything from anywhere, from anywhere. Not from any companies or anywhere. I haven't received any uh, fan mail or any letters from any of the female friends. Lots of things of importance. 